Now the Real Life Australian Grand Prix has finished, but I thought why not do one more race and not necessarily with F1 cars and as you can tell by the title and the thumbnail today we are racing 19 other safety cars in a full out safety car race which is insane of course this is the brand new safety car this year in 2022 from the Mercedes side of things and we're going to get into a race it's a last of first a quick little three lap race a bit of fun something different and not actually F1 cars and we're going to see what happens it should be chaotic carnage and hopefully you guys enjoy it so leave a like if you're going to like the race uh, let's try and smash over 1000 likes subscribe for more daily f1 content and if you want to see these cars return in the future for some other tracks and some other videos let me know in the comments down below but do get subscribed guys as we're on the road to 100k so any help would be massively appreciated as always the mods will be linked down below so yeah without further ado let's jump into it and uh, let me show you my gt7 slash forza skills with an actual gt car now I can tell you firsthand, this car is very good. It's a great mod, it's great fun to drive. So, here we go. The lights are on. And run away. Nice start off the line. Oh, bit of a a set of course AI usual kind of inconsistency as we head towards turn one. This is the new Albert Park layout, by the way. So uh, we're going to hopefully have a bit more fun. It should suit these cars a bit with the new back straight. As we try to get through here, making it three wide on the back straight. How late do we leave the braking for turn three? Got a bit of traffic ahead, so kind of need to be careful. Oh, God. AI car park. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Through turn four. Getting the back end out. Trying to drift through. Up the inside of a couple of cars there as they all get out of shape. Making good progress here. I'm not quite sure what position we're in. We'll update that across the start finish line. Through turn six we go. Great run through there as we close in on this guy ahead of us. Oh, he hits the brakes. We have to jam the brakes as well. And now into the new section. Flat out through here. Look at the straight line speed as we get past of a lift here as we understeer a bit on the brakes into the chicane sound the exit go 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 oh this is actually great here we go how late did we break here on the inside we just bumped the car ahead but we've made it work another place gained now the final couple of corners as we try to make some more progress here. Up the inside, using the wider track to our advantage. And now the final corner. Great exit there. Car on the left though, we'll have a slipstream from the car in front. We're kind of sharing it now though. Oh dear, that's a late one inside we go we'll take them both thank you very much but this guy's fighting back hold the phone now we're ahead oh there he's going back up the inside this is a decent little scrap inside for us through here as we drift the car through and I think we're into the top 10 Wide through there, but we're okay. Right, let's try and make some more progress then. This car's actually pretty insane, it feels pretty quick. It's really good fun to drive, you can drift it, kick the tail out. Ooh, I'm getting a bit hot through there. Almost done a signs Magnuson. Do I have enough to have a little look here? We're purple in all the mini sectors on the left hand side of the screen. Take a nice wide line here. Get the cut back. Lovely. Lovely, lovely. I've got the AR set to 95. It is only a three lap race, so I was planning on kind of fighting through the field a bit to give you guys some action. Been having a few PC issues as well, so I can't do super long races at the minute. So apologies for that. Let's see if we can. Set up the exit here. Nice, nice, nice. Come on. On to the last lap. Let's try and make things happen here. 
up the inside of turn one. On the brakes, kind of releasing them a little bit. Just to slide and coast into the corner. This guy's still keeping his nose in though. On the outside, we have to just downshift, otherwise we was going into the wall there. Side by side, drag race. Into turn three. Oh, that car heads at a moment. Over the curb, we're going to just take them both. And the outside we go. Thank you very much. We'll take that. Oh, we're flying. Look at this. Up the inside from here. Let's go. Come on. I think we can get a late podium out of this. Not exactly sure what position I'm in, but... If ain't a podium, it's not going to be far off. Here we go then. Along the back straight. Look at the straight line speed we have. We're going to cut underneath. That guy's got out of shape. He's all riding. We're going to go up the inside of him as well. Can I get it slowed down? Oh dear, I've done a signs of Magnuson. Just about held onto the car there. Making sure now we don't get overtaken into the brake zone. On the brakes, not quite sure where to brake as I'm using the other cars as a reference. Right, let's just nurse it through then. Find a couple of corners. Let's bring it home. I think it's going to be up P4 or P5. Up to the line we go. We'll take that. Really good, really good cars. I should really enjoy this race. Really refreshing. And it is P3. It's a podium. Let's go. Yes. Well, I must say, this was a lot of fun, man. These cars are actually surprisingly fun to drive. I mean, the car itself is a separate mod and this is just basically a livery mod on top of a car so um, these cars are you know well thought out and a lot of effort has gone into them in terms of modding so yeah really good combination man the track the car it fits really well it seems like we might do more of these especially around these kind of high speed circuits um, obviously Jetta has already happened but you know those type of circuits so we'll see what happens I think it could be definitely a little mini series we might do over the season but yeah if you guys enjoyed it then leave a like subscribe for more like I said in the intro let's try and Help me on the way to 100k by the end of the year. And if you want to check out the mods, like I said, link down below. This is on a Seto Corsa on PC. So that is what's going to work for. You can't mod on console. And this is the old Seto Corsa, the 2014 version of the game. So, yeah, that's it, guys, from me here today. Hopefully you enjoyed it. And, uh, yeah, as always, a massive, massive thanks to the channel members for supporting the content. Finally, check out the two videos on your screen if you haven't seen them already. But that's it from me here today. And I'll see all of you in the next one.